Good morning, what's happening? Happy Sunday. Welcome back for another video. Back on the other farm this week. Um, obviously last week was Massey Ferguson's Dairy Master Parlor and Dorset's. This week we are back into a 20 point parlor. And I have to say, I think, I think I prefer the 20 point parlor. Just gonna put that out there. But today's job is to increase the feeding space around the shed. So obviously on this farm, there is one feed passage and going forward, we'd like more space around outside of the shed to feed. So this is just the start of this. We're gonna take off the tin that is on the side of the shed already. Um, we have a feed barrier to move to like the other side and raise up. And then we have bunkers to put in, concrete bunkers to put in. So hopefully we can feed like right around the outside of the shed as opposed to just the inside feed passage. So that's what we're gonna do today. No idea how that's gonna work out in a video, but we're all learning. Should just add, um, obviously part of the reason for increasing feed space is there's quite a few heifers in the herd this year and with heifers being like further down the hierarchy or further down the, the pecking order as such in the herd obviously you need to have sufficient space and, and more space than you need so that they feel comfortable coming forward um, when they're comfortable coming forward then obviously intakes will increase milk will increase um, fertility gets better that kind of thing so there's lots of benefits of having that extra feed space over and above everybody being able to eat like at the same time if that makes sense so that's kind of the idea behind it anyway and i will show you what is happening now
okay over halfway done um got them in i know it looks like i'm not doing very much but <laughs> no i um as he's pushing them in i'm kind of telling him like a little bit more this side a little bit more that side push them in the middle that kind of thing um just trying to get them lined up as evenly as possible you will notice this um let's cut me off this feed bar uh is on the wrong side obviously whenever the tin was in here it had to sit like in between something so this bar will be unscrewed flipped to the outside um and then obviously raised up a bit more just so that it is super comfortable for the cows to eat out of these bunkers and then obviously whenever we get this bar swapped to the other side there will need to be something that like sits down over the bunker to Firstly, to stop the rain getting in, um, to encourage the cows to continue to put their heads out, but then also something that can be like moved up out of the road so the diet feeder can feed in uh, without being like blocked. Some sort of like louver tin or something on a pulley system. Every time we say goodbye, they all see that it's a lie. Cause we always give it one last try Yeah, you've watched me break a thousand times Now I'm all alone Cause you never show You say you will But then you don't That's how it goes Don't wanna know I'm turning off my mind so I get by I just wanna be happy I just wanna be 